carry from uh, Samasue. And Rabula has the quick ball. He like attacking again. A wonderful offload. Beautiful score. Wakanalanga is in for Fiji. The absolutely perfect response to the mall try scored by the junior Wallabies. With the lineup throw for the Wallabies. No contest from Fiji. They were waiting for this mall, but they have not been able to stop its advance. This is brilliant work from Australia. And in the end, it's a pretty simple score for the hooker. Liam Barron. They're playing out the back beautifully in a wonderful line now by Vaiu. Looking for the inside ball, gets it. Pass not going to hand at first, but the follow-up is brilliant from Bloomfield. Oh, that's good skill, isn't it? Again, it's Australia employing this series of pick and drives. They are definitely within striking distance here. Thought that was over the line, but just held up. Again, short. Some heroic defending from Fiji here. Which way does Bowen go? And he goes this time for the backs and a canter in under the post for David Vahu. Stretch those long legs. The second row, Masaka Vothe Vothe. And still Fiji with an opportunity. Well, a try awarded. It looked as though, again, he might have had a little bit of a crawl with a knee on the ground. But uh, Morty Murray... Fiji is captain, has been awarded the try. And what they, what they with the initial break. Just had too much pace for everyone else. But Moti Mari, talk about tackle fight. Fiji being forced very much into defensive mode in the opening passage here of the second half. Little show of the ball, then the give for Vahu. Brilliant ball on the outside. That's a spectacular, brilliant score from Ronan Lee. Asking a couple of more defensive questions. Then uh, Brighton leg. Nick Baker has to roll out of there. The Wallabies captain. Basalana picking his man and picking him beautifully. What can they do with uh, a short pass and a pick and drive strategy that Australia have deployed? pretty effectively in this game well driven to the line and over <laughs> wow Misaki Vote Vote was packing in behind to provide the extra momentum but the score is from Naka level <laughs> There's a man who stayed down for Fiji after making the tackle as well. Australia looking for more than just a penalty in front of the post here. They're effectively 14 against 14 now. Another penalty advantage. Pick up from King. Edging ever closer. Fiji still a man down. It looks like he's got cramped. So out of the game. And it comes out the back for Wilson, then Bowen, and up from fullback is Gordon. And again, some excellent advantage played by referee Namakawa. And Australia staying patient on the ball. Fiji cleaned off the ball. Beautiful pass from Bowen. And it's Lancaster on the left wing. He is lightning, lightning quick. And Australia, quick tries back to back, have reclaimed the lead in dramatic style. Superb from Bowen in the build-up. Yeah, Darby Lancaster, too much pace. But you've got to look at the decision-making of Teddy Wilson. 
how he just works it beautifully, picks the right hand side. Bowen goes for the outside break at the two and one. And Lancaster, he's got jet shoes, doesn't he? Down the touchline, over he goes, and just like that. And then when Australia went down to 14 men with a red card, yellow initially upgraded via the bunker to Marley Pierce. And Fiji took the lead. You sensed that they were headed for a special piece of history. Huge scrum effort from Fiji, but it's not enough as Jack Bowen kicks the ball into the stands here. And Australia can celebrate a hard-fought, ultimately deserved victory.